Day four this is our last full day on the water. Uh, staying basically on Lake Amistad tonight, and then we're heading into Rough Canyon in the morning. But yeah, should be an awesome day. I have a top water bait tied on a little bit in the morning. I might throw it around here right as we start out. Um, so I did catch a few in this area last night. So let's get on the river, eat a little breakfast, and uh, get going. All right, where we go? Oh, I missed it. Did you get him? I got him. That was really quick, huh? A largey. He missed it the first time. Ain't bad. We can already eat that thing. That's how they're all eating, like, every lure. Come on, there. There we go. Sweet. I do have them. Get a tiny small one. Take a this. That's a little son of a bitch. <laughs> Bold. How can see it, I think? My bad, brother. My bad. <laughs> Not quite the right species, but. There we go. Made a quick little cast right by this bush here as I was going down, guys. Oh, oh man. Oh, that was almost really bad. Let's so pull them out. Beautiful and small, guys. He almost got me with that treble hook. Cool. Chris, if they wanted. Well. I think it's anything here. You got him? Yeah. Oh, okay. God. 
Dang, they're eating this thing. Smally. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. Let's chill. There we go. Nice and chill. Bit of Smally. Cool little guy. They're smoking this little top water. Yeah, that was such a cool eat, dude. That was. He yoinked on that. Right as we were about to head out, and this guy dolphins it. Oh, real. Do you want a picture with me? I want a picture for sure. Alright. That was so cool. That was a really cool. I thought he was big, bro, because he came up and did the little dolphin. Basically, dolphined it. He ain't big, though. Chill there, buddy. Your hand, bad. I'd eat him. Alright, buddy. This guy came up out of like five or six foot of water and straight smoked the walking bait, man. Wow, it's stuck up in there. Yeah. There we go. Cool. Yo. Oh. Nice. Got him? No, I don't. Oh, he's still after. He's still after. Good. He's still on it. Got him that time. That's a good one. That's a good largey. Dude, that was so cool. Oh, he's not. He's not even as big. I thought he was like a two pounder. He's not the. One and a half. One and three quarters, maybe. I've never seen a large you do that though. I thought that was a smallie for sure. Oh, he's smoking it. Oh, sorry, buddy. Nice, dude. Super easy, barely an inconvenience. Come on, buddy, chill. Uh, the one and a quarter. Two from here. Yeah, that's for dragging no matter what. Top water. We're gonna do it anyway, though. Let's see if we can do it. Oh, got him! Instantaneous. Good smallie, I think. That's a largey. Pretty good largey, huh? Three pounder. I think that's a. No, it is a small jaw. It's a small jaw. That was instantaneous, dude. It's pretty cool. Not that big, actually. Oh, he might be. 
Don't hook me, buddy. Don't hook me. That's not even my house. Oh, that's a good one. It looks pretty good. That is a good one. That's a good one. Dude, look at the head on that thing. Dang, four pound head, three pound body. Look at that thing. Dude, that was... Nah, that's a small jaw. He's a little skinny, otherwise he, like, if he was filled out, he'd probably be four pounds. Look at how he ate that thing. Yeah, here, can you get a picture of, like, the bait in his mouth, too? Yeah. Yes, it does. So, I will. Let's check this out right here. There he is. That was instantaneous, dude. Oh. Wow. No, they're all, they're, well, they're in such predictable spots. Yeah. <laughs> there's not many other places for them to be. Yeah. I like that cover. Is this a smallie or another smallie, I think? Um, that one's small. Yeah, a little smallie. Small jaw. Get back your book that. This is tiny. Yeah. There we go, guys. Gotta be a smaller back here, right?
One of the last big hurdles of the trip, I believe. Look at them. A couple of them little guys. What a super clear, what a super clear hair, guys. In like five foot of water now. So cool, crystal clear water. We were just back swimming in a little area and it was, I think it was like seven foot, probably seven foot deep. And I mean, you could see to the bottom, no problem. Awesome, awesome swimming water. But yeah, pretty cool. Buddy. deep this is. I could go in. It's a carp. It's really deep here. So we're just kind of floating now. I wanted to make a cast of that bass, but it is what it is. We've caught a ton this week. Okay. Still can't reach the bottom. Yeah. Alright. See what we can do for a second. Guys, I hooked him. I was turning the GoPro on and these came off, but. Dang it. I was turning the GoPro on and he came off, but I, I hooked that fish. Just, uh, yeah, not for long though. I 
There he is. Got him. Oh, that's a good smelling. That is not the Ah, uh, no, I guess it is the same fish. I thought it was a largey, though. Oh, buddy. He's trying to break me off on the rocks. Saw a two pounder. I'm gonna go and grab him, I guess. Oh, he's bigger than I thought. Two and a quarter. That right there, guys. He smoked my walking bait a second ago, and then he kept wanting to come back for it, but he wouldn't, wouldn't commit because I already hooked him for a second. Um, so yeah. Two pound and maybe two and a quarter. It's pretty cool. He's beat up, he's been through it. That's cool. That's really cool. I kept watching him dart around, go after my walking bait and stuff, and I switched over to that little swim bait. And like second cast, boom. Pretty neat. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. Start. That's some fun. Don't tear my line up, buddy. There's no need for that. You're not big. <laughs> Guy came up and inhaled it. Nice one. Yeah, it's cold. At least it is up here. Yeah, damn it. Yeah. Oh, dude, I'm gonna grab some of my grail. See so, yeah, how that spring water is. Oh, cool. Oh, it's good. Our water's clean, baby. Wow. Pretty cool. Oh, it's pretty cool out here. Look at that, more another spring.
buddy. He's so cute. Oh my gosh, look at you. Hi, girl. You're good. I got you. Oh, you're good. Don't step in the water. Oh, wow. You're going to explore, no? Oh, sorry. I'm sorry, girl. It's a bunch of mud. Wow. What? Yeah. Hey, girl. Careful. Careful, girl. Careful. Who's up there? Alrighty guys, got to a campsite. Just pulled up along the shore here. A little bit muddy trying to get out of the kayaks, but it is what it is. I'm gonna eat up this dessert. I might grab some uh, I might grab some cactus fruit. It looks like there's a bunch of like ripe cactus fruit right up there on that little ridge there. And I figure if I don't get them, then the little Iodad or uh, mountain goats whatever they are they're running around there's a mix of them but whatever it is running around i'm gonna eat them so if they're ripe i might grab some cut them up and uh because they do taste good so we will see and if not uh get ready for bed get camp set up and we will see y'all in the morning this is our final full this is actually our final night here and then tomorrow we got about five miles to go and then we are done just headed back to rough canyon we are fully on lake Amistad right now so should be good pretty clear smooth sailing other than the winds there should be probably some wind so get some uh waves and stuff but shouldn't be too bad so we'll see y'all when we see y'all all righty guys final morning we got about a five mile paddle uh, back into rough canyon marina that's where we're getting off that's where our journey ends so been an awesome trip just got a little bit longer got to get back in our kayaks should be off i think around noon or so um, it really shouldn't be that long, but, uh, yeah, been an awesome time. Thank you all for coming along on this ride for us. What? Huh? Thank you all for coming along on this ride with us. Uh, yeah, it's been fun. Let's head in. Canyon Marina. Oh, that feels good. We have arrived at Rough Canyon Marina. This is the end of our Devil's River Adventure. I gotta get stuff, oh, that's the end of our Devil's River Adventure. I gotta get stuff unloaded and uh, gotta go get a bite to eat. Alrighty guys, that's gonna do it for this trip. We got the kayaks all loaded up back here. We're about to head out. We've had an awesome time here. Hope y'all enjoyed this whole series. I mean, it was fantastic. I'll definitely be coming back. Hopefully once that water flow, um, gets a little bit higher because we had to do a good bit of dragging but had a ton of fun nonetheless super cool seeing the springs and how cold that water is and getting to drink some of that cool spring water straight from the source um that's awesome guys yeah we had a ton of fun it's very very enjoyable got to camp right on the side of the river on some rock had some awesome awesome views got to see some awesome stargazing um, this is like a dark sky zone um i forget the technical term for it but so as long as there isn't like a seriously bright moon like we had on quite a few of the nights we had most of the nights a really bright moon um, but it is a dark sky area so you will get to see a lot of stars and it is 
awesome. And the river is very nice and cool. You can jump in at Dolan's Falls, all that good stuff. So thank you guys for watching. We'll see you on the next river adventure.